So after much needed training, which I only got a few EXP, so I got the furs and the mucus and junk, so we got the really sticky glue. We could do something later on, and then we have the tiger fur, which also turn in, so now we're almost level up. So now, we have to kill Zalzazane, kill Voodoo Trolls, and get Minchena's skull. So we're gonna have to head back into the Echo Isles. Also, more about the game while we get there, we also have Reputation, which is inc which is our standing in all the races, and like they, they give you benefits. Like there's more than just these reputations. Like these are just for the horde. So then, we also had to do this quest, thwarting the coal car aggression, which we had to destroy work with our attack plans, engine village attack plans, and value trials. But it's pretty high level. Like there are a bunch of annoying mobs down there, so then we're gonna have to do it later. We have to focus on <laughs> killing the trolls. We have to kill this tiger. So I'm just gonna kill this tiger here. I do kill this tiger. We're gonna head into the main island. It's full of ruins. So, <coughs> 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 oh. after we're done killing the tiger, we're gonna have to get to the island. So about the shaman, um, uh, we, we ran out of skills to upgrade in the trainer in the Valley of Trials, so then I think they were going to have to head into Razor Hill for more upgrades. Razor Hill is pretty far away, like there's also another space around the sea, it's uh, for quests, so then uh, so that's another thing that's blocking the way. So we're in the main island, so then the raptors. Uh, paired up with tigers. So. Alright. I rally bolts do, do, do pretty low damage for now, but it's gonna be increased over time. So I, I'm just gonna have to stick with maces and shields because. I just need uh, uh, to be more melee efficient in case I run out of mana. So here are hex trolls. Get to kill them. They're a bit high level. Hopefully we can kill them. Let's place down the token. So that is one of the of the many hex trolls you have to kill. Wood trolls are slightly harder because they have healing spells and they also have a lightning shield which which is a sham another sham skill that we'll be obtaining later on. So like really all you have to do is kill them. We're not gathering anything. It's just a grinding quest. So while on this you have to go to find Min China's skull. So if we head into Zal Zalzing Zal Zalzing's camp, you'll we'll find his skull. It doesn't need any combat, we just have to gather his skull without dying. So let's kill this troll to death. We got tough jerky. 
and now so I guess this is Alzine's camp that hill has has a Minchina skull so we have to head up that hill good thing we have healing spells so then we don't die but then I can easily run out of mana so then mana is a real problem So that's, uh, we killed four trolls. There are voodoo trolls here, and this is Zalzane. Zalzane is pretty high leveled. You have to pick him off. Oh, while he's alone. Like, I, well, I guess to find him kind of like a boss, because he's level 10. He's quite high level. We're only level six so far. You see, you have to stealthily run up this hill. Crap. So Immolate is a warlock move, so then there are warlocks, warlock trolls and shaman trolls. The troll, the, the trolls can be a few, quite a few classes, they could be death knight, shaman, mage, priest I think, warlock, warrior, rogue, hunter. So I don't I don't know what's over that hill, but then so that's a risk we're going to take. So then we get Manchina skill, objective complete. That's that's good. So now we have to continue to um, kill the, the trolls. When the trolls can heal themselves because they're also shamans, so then that's a pretty big problem. So they burst them down quickly with Earth Shock. Good thing they don't spam it like like a real player would. Like real players would if they were low on health. So that's pretty nice. Then we uh, we need to strategically place totems where they are, uh, so then we can um so we don't have to move the totems all that often. I just left behind my totem. 16 seconds remaining. I should resell another one. It gives a few benefits. The thing about shamans is that they have these spells with shocks. Like frost shock, fire sh flame shock, I think. Fire shock. Frost shock, flame, earth shock, etc. Also, we have shields, like elemental shields that will protect us. So that's pretty slow if we have to go melee. So we kill all everything we need for the hex trolls. Now we have to kill. The voodoo trolls, and hopefully Zalazane later on. So I'll pick off this troll. Good thing that they go melee and they don't try and do spells because trying to do spells will put us out of range. We essentially have to do like 300 damage or so in order to kill them because because they're likely to cast spells or healing spells. We got lightning cloth. They're good for tailoring first aid, but I don't need tailoring since I'm a freaking shaman. So voodoo trolls only reside.